Riley Duck and today's YouTube video is going to be DIY Crunchy Slime and I personally love this type of slime so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel down below. Thank you so much for a thousand subscribers that means so much to me and this is also a collaboration with Little Emma so make sure to go down in the description box and subscribe to her channel and check out her video and without further ado let's get started. To make this slime you will need glue, shaving cream, Activator, which you actually need to use borax for this one because it didn't work when I used eye contact solution. You're also going to need food coloring or paint, which is optional, but it looks way better with it. And some styrofoam beads to make it all crunchy. I don't know exactly what these are called, but you know. Um, and then a bowl and spoon to make the slime in. And also a container so it doesn't dry out. So first things first, you're just going to pour your glue into your bowl. And now add shaving cream, and I don't have exact measurements for this, you're just going to add a whole bunch, and then mix that all together until it's well combined, and now you're just going to add a couple drops of your food coloring, and now it's time to activate. As I said earlier, I started with um, eye contact solution, and it didn't work, I don't know if it was like the glue maybe, or maybe this eye contact solution doesn't work, but as you can tell, it was super runny and it was not forming any slime. So I took out my borax, which you will be needing, and I just put a little bit in and it started to create slime. So you will need borax for this not eye contact solution. I want to make that very clear. Once you want your slime a little bit sticky so the beads stick in it, I added a little bit of shaving cream and then I started to knead it all together and it started to peel off the side. So I thought it was ready. So I just kneaded it a whole bunch more before I added any beads. And then I added all the big beads in and I started to mix that together and the slime was so sticky and it was not working out for me and I couldn't get it to like not be sticky so I added some more borax to it and mixed that all together and it was the perfect like slime ever. And then I added some of these other beads. They're much smaller and I thought it would just look cool with different colors. So I mixed that all in and then this slime was so crunchy. I love it so much. And now when you're not using it, just make sure you put it in a container and it's sealed up so it doesn't dry out. And that's pretty much it. Bye guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then make sure you give it a big thumbs up. And can we get 50 thumbs up because that would be amazing. And also make sure to subscribe to my channel down below. And also do not leave without watching Emma's video. She's doing DIY clear slime and it's going to be a good one. So make sure to go watch it. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.